Hello guys, welcome back to the session. This is the third video in this series, and we are going to create the Docker image in the local system, and run it on the 3000 port. You can skip this session, if you know how to run a Docker image in your local PC. There is no dependency on this session, with our ACR and ACI deployment. Open the Docker file which is inside the source code folder. Now, to run the Docker image in your local system, first you have to install Docker in your system. Once Docker is installed in your system, open the readme.md file, where I mention how we can run the Docker file in your local system. As I am using Ubuntu operating system, I will use sudo as prefix to get admin access. If you are running the same on a Windows system, this sudo command is not required. First we want to run the npm install and see it's all working. For that open the control terminal and direct to the right folder. Now you can run npm install, this will create a node module folder in the project, and download all the node modules mentioned in the package.json. You can run this index.json file using npm start command. Anyway we are going to run this inside the docker image now. Copy the second command from the readme.md file. This is to build the docker image on your local system. After hyphen t you can give your own docker image name. Also you can give a version after the name. And the final dot stands for the current folder. Docker finds the file in the directory, with the name docker file, in the current directory and executes it. As mentioned in our docker file, it downloads the node server, and create an image in the local system. Then it sets the current working directory to user slash src slash app. In the next step when we say slash, it takes the app folder as current folder. Then, copy package.json file inside the docker image. Now it executes the run npm install command inside the docker image. This will create the node module folder inside our docker image. Next step is to copy all the other files to the app folder. Then, set the application to run on 8080 port. And finally, we are executing the index.js file using node command. This will execute the file while the docker image is running. Now, to see the images which are running in the docker, we can use the command docker images. This will list all the images which are there in the system. We can see the image which we created just now. Following step is to run our docker image in our system by executing the next command. This will run the docker on 3000 port. Hyphen D stands for detached mode. Now open the browser and we can check the application running on the port 3000. Here you go. The return value is hello world. Okay, now we are done. The docker image is running on our local PC. That's it for this session. In the next session, we will be pushing the source code to the Azure Remote Repo. See you soon.